Did someone say cock? Good morning, Ranger Riley. <coughs> Boshi moshi! Ay 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 Any cuties playing Kaizo? Taps fingers together shyly. Bro Jared was a video YouTuber whose ex-wife came out and said a bunch of very murky damaging stuff that turned out largely to not be true. He did scripts on video games? God damn, dude. God damn. Yeah. I mean, the thing is, right? I, I, I discussed this very, like, I, I put a tweet out about this. We, we are living in a post-truth society what I mean by that, what I mean by that is what people want to believe to be true is far more important to them than what is actually truth. And this happens on a day-to-day -day basis. It literally happens all over the place. On both sides of the political spectrum, it happens all the fucking time. Just a reminder, Joe, if EverQuest is launching a new tip server this week, yeah, time time lock progression. <laughs> Influx of people play next Thursday. Oh, thanks for the reminder. Thanks for the reminder. Press pause to see the current song being played. Thanks, Benevic. Please note that it doesn't work in levels with layer 3 background. Super bomb, Twilight Space. Natalie, good morning. Wow. I wonder if this is possible to do. Come on, sing. Happy dance. Maybe. Happy dance. Rolling on Chrome, thanks for the tier one sub to sloth Rappy Oppy Poppy Poopy. I think that was the best derivative of your name. This just explode into hearts. God fucking. I better see some milkies. Oh. Fucking gotcha, meats. You've been clickbaited. He needs it. I don't appreciate being lied to. I can't believe they explode into hearts. Alright. Uh, good morning, Scargon. Happy Wednesday, baby weasel. Oh. Emily OD, good morning. That was pretty cute. How am I? I'm great. I'm great. So, uh, what's going on, Idea Litter? Good day, everyone. Liking the song already. You gotta love the clip of Amber Heard saying, I didn't punch you, I hit you. <laughs> God, that trial, dude. I hate to say I love the trial, but it's like a movie. It's like an ongoing movie.
Uh, is Chad not on screen on purpose? No. Thank you, Emily. enough it's such a shit show it's both absolutely funny and sad at the same time I was just saying it earlier on how I, I just I think this is such an important reminder that People need to stop jumping to conclusions on literally fucking everything. Maybe I shouldn't spin jump there. Noblet, you are the best. I don't know if I'm the best. In fact, I'm certain I'm not the best. I do my best though, that's for sure. Oh, Red with Rage, thanks for 17 months of Prime Gaming. I agree with you, Idealator. Everyone I hear saying Johnny is innocent, blah, blah. I personally feel they both came out of this terribly. This trial really just shows how unhealthy both of them are. Wow, they both need a lot of help. Oh, I fucking damn, dude. Slamma Wama Ding Dong, thanks for two years. Life finds a way, thanks for 19 months. Thank you, guys. Holy shit. Uh, what? That was weird. Johnny's not innocent. I mean, Johnny's not innocent, but it's definitely not as bad as Amber Heard made it out to be. I bet I have to hit this. Oh. Seems like a toxic person, but not abusive. What the hell am I doing here? Anyone see a clip of Amber doing a bump on the stand? You see, this is exactly th this right here. Hey, baby weasel, thanks for saying it. This right here is exactly what I mean when I say we live in post-truth. People saw the clip of Amber Heard, immediately drew the conclusion that she took a bump, and didn't even give her the benefit of the doubt fucking that maybe she was just blowing her nose ass, because they dislike her so much. Holy shit, shit. Drewzilla, thank you for 35 months and the tier three. That is such a long time. It's people are willing to draw conclusions and believe it as truth, period. Whether she took a bump of coke or not, I don't really give a fuck. I just find it so interesting.
could be a small install at the end of the day. A exactly, exactly. But I find it so interesting that people are immediately willing to just throw any idea out the window other than she took a bump of coke. That, that happened, you know? What's going on, hometown team? It doesn't work, Loco Stokos, I have no idea. Who's doing coke? Uh, probably Tommy Lee Jones. Oh, I get it. I get it now. I get it. I was I was being a silly. I needed that, didn't I? No, I didn't. You have little context of what's going on. Dude, I am this fucking close to just pulling up the court for the whole day. Fuck Mega Man. Mega Man can wait. We're just gonna watch the court case all fucking day. I'm this close to doing it. It's the uh, Amanda Heard Johnny Depp trial. Keep the change, you filthy animal. Uh, Dargon, thanks for the hundred bits. You've never seen people so obsessed? You know, I think that the reason people really enjoy watching it is because it's a break from your life to see a glimpse into the life of a genuine superstar. Yeah, he's an idol and seeing this case and seeing how fucked up his life is and how fucked up he's had things, I think really shines a light on or I, I think people are just really drawn to it yeah but OJ fucking killed someone OJ fucking killed someone it, yeah it adds perspective fucking Am I saying killing someone is worse? Yeah, yes. Yes, that, 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 that is precisely what I'm saying. Oh. Killing someone is way worse than, what, what, what is the trial? It's a uh, defamation trial, right? Evidence is all that matters. Well, that that's what I've been saying all morning, Drew, is I'm, I'm happy that this court case is showing, it's showing that doesn't matter if, it does it, race and gender should not matter on why someone should believe you. Evidence should prove why someone believes you. And the world is so eager to jump on 
anyone's side without any fucking evidence, period. Thus, going back to the whole... People are willing to believe what they want to believe, and it's far more important than what's actually true. Suing her for an op-ed she posted to the Washington Post and since uh, he has lost out on movies. I mean, he's already said that he's never going to be recast as uh, John, or not Johnny Depp. He's already Johnny Depp as Jack Sparrow ever again, right? Because Disney abandoned him. Amber got hammered on a stand by Johnny's lawyers. Dude, she fucking earned it. She fucking earned it. And then when her attorney came on, she had like 300 questions that were all basically trying to lie to the court. Yeah, he lost the Harry Potter role. Did you guys see that they're already uh, making a new Pirates movie? They're making a new Pirates movie. Ezra Miller didn't. You know what's really crazy, right? You know what's really crazy? There's people that are saying stuff like attorneys shouldn't be allowed to talk to their witness like the way Johnny Depp's lawyer is talking to Amber Heard. What's going on, Rain? What's going on? He was going to be in Harry Potter. Yeah, he was uh, Grindelwald. Yeah, right, Drew? It's like, have they never seen a trial? Have they never seen a trial before? Dude, I've seen attorneys be way worse than the way she's being. But I need this. I did need it. Civil cases are different than criminal ones. I mean, if it's in a trial though, like it's in a trial. One shot that entire second section. Really proud of that one. Wolf of Boro. Let me have a mushroom. Thank you. There's only one obstacle that was out of place. Ah, okay. 
it's after this. One, two, three. Jump up. Who here thinks Barb can beat? Or Tova can beat Barb's world record? Uh, I know I could. And that's not shade to Barb, that's just because I know Barb doesn't give a fuck. the South Park episodes of all this. When was the last time Barb did like serious speed runs? The last one I could think of would be Gungeon. Or maybe Hades runs. He did uh Hades speed runs for a while, didn't he? Barb didn't grind that seriously? Yeah, I mean I this morning he wasn't playing it. So what do you do, like five playthroughs or something? Well, that was a very short level. He ran it six times. He got down to 17 minutes yesterday. Hey, what's up, get lucky? Streets of Rage was like two years ago. Maybe even three. How many exits is this? I have no idea. No clue. Oh. Oh, I see. Any more Legends play? Uh, yeah, later today. Unless I decide to spend the whole day watching the uh, the trial. going Carlos please don't promise I'm not promising a goddamn thing if I want to stream it I'm gonna stream it thoughts so far on what oh it's ice physics. you mean uh, Mega Man Legends oh the hack uh, this hacks fantastic that's sad what's sad Sweet little girl. Uh, get lucky. Thanks for 11 months. That fucking counts, dude. Let's fucking go. That counts. 
I have this juicy watermelon candle burning and it is lovely. Foxo, Foxo, good morning. Skins here are great. Yeah, agreed. Very fun. Bonsai Blizzard. Oh, this acts great. I, I love that even for a beginner, I could see people struggle like beginners actually struggling. Well, that's 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 a good thing. Composer song? Oh, is it? Your Zeph for Exeron is probably your favorite run to watch. Yeah, I spent some time yesterday learning two levels, two, two, three levels. And shit. I figure, you know, the best way to start getting into speedruns is to just start fucking doing them. physical copy of the article that you're in very nice speaking of speedruns it's how you found me three years ago is when you started subbing which tells me that you followed me when i was doing speedruns of grand pool 2 probably because of Barb's YouTube compilation. You'd be surprised how many people found me similarly, Ranger Riley. Discovered me from watching a random YouTube of Pooh playing Dram 2. I then fell into SMW rabbit hole of Pooh, Barb, you, Laser, etc. I followed because people said nice things about you. That's a that's dude, that's 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 new. I've never heard that one before. Usually people say they followed me because they heard I'm a fucking asshole. <laughs> I follow for verbal assault, yeah. You swear that's true? Because the, no no no, I'm gonna show you guys something. I'm gonna I'm gonna show you guys something. I, I I probably shouldn't like bring any attention to it, but I'm going to because I think it's so funny. Uh, here, hold on, hold on, let me find this. Come on. So the other day, 
the other day, right? I was doing um on Sunday night. Sunday night, I was learning the speed run. Come on, see. Happy dance. The Mega Man X. Happy dance. Uh, I do it. Thank you for the tier two gift sub to Boozy703. Thank you so much. Yeah, Boozy, uh, my rule here, if you haven't seen, is getting a tier two sub means you are being forced to uh, submit an unbanner quest. So, I'll see ya. So, anyways, I'm learning how to speedrun Mega Man X, right? Learning how to do it. And of course, like dozens of people from the Mega Man community decide to come in and try to start helping. And you guys know me. I don't like help unless I very specifically ask for it. So some cunt came in, some cunt came in and started trying to help me unsolicited. So I banned him. I banned him. I banned him and uh, kind of made fun of him, right? You know, I did the, the, the whole thing that I do. So this is a DM that I got. This is a DM that I got. Which tells me banning this guy was probably a good idea. So let's see. Hi, you are an actual fucking piece of shit, and I want you to really know that. You disgust me, you fucking bald, egged head piece of shit. The way you treated Berlin dude was not okay. You're an asshole for no reason at all. Berlin dude is a really nice guy, and he wasn't self- he was actually self-advertising. Uh, he was simply trying to help your pathetic ass on an easy strat. Enjoy being asshole some more. Fuck you. <laughs> Dude, I love th this. This kind of shit emboldens me. This kind of shit emboldens me. Oh man, when people when that, when people send me that, when people send me that, I get a pip in my step. I get a fucking pip in my step. Wow. <laughs> when is extra egghead coming to Twitch? Someone's gotta make it. Wow. Someone turn extra evil into Robotnik, and then I'll make it egg. We have an unbanner quest coming in from Boozy. Boozy says, who will who else will contribute love and positivity in this cesspool? Anyways, you ran Mega Man X for a total of two months and you never heard of Berlin, dude? Cesspool. You guys hear that? You guys are a pool of cess. How does that make you feel? Hashtag blessed. Test bath water. Ah! It makes me mad, you bald egghead something something. Cesspool reminds me of the beginning of Infinite Annihilator song, Empusa. Do I want Jim Carrey Robotnik or old ass Eggman Robotnik? Oh man, I don't know chat, what do you think? I've been in pools of horse. <laughs> carry, carry, everyone's saying carry. OG. He did do the character justice. He really did. Oh yeah, yeah, he carried the movie. You gotta think that most interactions that Jim Carrey had, there was no one else on set because it was all CG. He did, it, Jim Carrey did such a good job as uh, Eggman.
Pickles Port Hype. You haven't seen the first one? I think one and two complement each other. Like, in my opinion, one and two are one whole movie together. Shoulder button be pressed for the level completion by you to make Sprite. Is that how I'm supposed to do it? Oh, and then he kicks the thing. That makes sense. That makes sense. That's really cool. you need on the other side is uh greater than I guess depending on which way you're looking at me some resilience okay less than whatever you guys know I'm not good at math bullshit Shortest level in the universe? Am I throwing hearts? I'm throwing hearts. It's average! What's going on, Dbic? Sounds like a skill issue. Spatial reasoning, re reasoning, spatial reasoning, pattern recognition are very mathematical. Are you trying to simp for me right now? Yump! Yumpies! Reasoning. Back here. I mean, you're a dumb cunt. There, don't ban me. I wouldn't ban you. I've been called way worse in the past five years I've been streaming. Oh, you're fine. You're fine. I went crazy and shaved my head on stream. L. 
ratio, bald, egghead, dumb asshole. Habanero Haven. I can't have spicy food. I was gaming for a second. Oh, okay, got it. Got it, got it, got it. Have you, have there been any Grand Pro 3 new releases lately? Uh, yeah, go ask Barb. Yeah, go ask Barb. He uh, he actually just released. No, that's a lie. <laughs> I'm not saying shit to Barb. I'm not that stupid. That's why I asked you. No. He said he's unmotivated. Uh, some guy in chat tried telling Barb how to just not be lazy. That went out really well. That, 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 that ended up having a great turnout. Yeah, just don't be lazy. No, great advice. He had, he had these great, like, this great four-step program on how to not be lazy. Twitch chat. Uh, very clever. This is very cool. What is it gonna say? Put the key through this through me, senpai. I, I was hoping it was gonna say something else. No! Fuck! Thank you. 
and then complain that it isn't as good as the last one. Oh, I'm blind as fuck. I'm sitting here like, where's the last key at? mushroom there wait is there something in it I, I might need that actually oh it's got oh, okay so I do need that got it got it got it got it no I need it I keep trying to naturally avoid it See what's next. Oh. Probably an orb up there. level reminds you of the old Windows 3.1 slash DOS games. So less tax. I recently did a second playthrough of the game and wanted to see if there was a small hack I could try. There's like hundreds of them. You hope it gets traction like SMW Central. You know, the only problem with Celeste is Celeste controls like shit. <laughs> I'm kidding. Just kidding. God, I love Celeste. I feel like the Celeste fans are like Undertale fans. If you insult Celeste, they're like... Fandom, don't critique my favorite game. Yeah, basically, right? God of War difficulty, I've heard from Barb specifically, is just, it's superfluous. It's, it's the artificial difficulty, you know, thing. All they do to make the game difficult is pump up damage numbers, HP meters, and make there more enemies. Which is just, it's such a huge problem whenever it comes to difficulty scaling. 
It, companies just don't have enough resources to essentially make five different games. And that that's what it would take. I love the game, man. Don't get me wrong. It's up there with Dark Souls and Mario Odyssey. It's up there, you know? But I had such a bad time playing God Mode, God of War. Yeah, I think I think that's just like a common that's a common trend whenever it comes to adding difficulty. Yo, what's up, third wall? Yeah, I agree. Well, this is fucking cool. This is fucking cool. Yeah, get get lucky. I think that is a very good structure for difficulty. But it's it's you know there's so many people who like demand that Elden Ring and other Souls games get a difficulty scale because not everyone has enough time to be playing hundreds of hours of video games like for some reason that's what it takes. What? Oh, I'm supposed to jump on the falling thing. Yeah, and it's like you you can't you can't scale. I I just don't see any companies that are giving like an easy normal hard mode. You know, nor easy normal hard, very hard, and then godlike, and actually making it like interesting. It's always. Buff the bars, buff the damage, increase number of enemies. It's never anything interesting. It's never anything interesting. Doom Eternal did it really well. I only played Doom Eternal on Ultra Violent. It's a gold standard for difficulty. Yeah, dude, Hades. Oh, I see. Rogue Legacy 2 did a decent job. I mean, depending on how you look at it, Elden Ring does have an easy mode. Elden Ring, in a way, does have an easy mode if you if you look at it. Depending on your playstyle for the game, Mario Maker 2 does it the best. sick.
Damn, that was really sick too. Start at the hardest and work your way back. That way the hardest isn't some manufactured bullshit. What the fuck? Same here, beast. Same here. How did I... Yeah, you're not supposed to spin. You've been doing some stuff with stacks. I get it. I get it. I get it. I get it. This is sick. Hi. No, you're supposed to then spin jump. Is that good? Dude, this hack is so sick. Oh, uh, what's up, Sethus? Jump, you moron. No, I am not attending GDQ or running anything at GDQ. No, my plan this year is to stand back and rake in all the viewers looking for a home. What the fuck am I doing here? Yeah, I'm just gonna sit there and just fucking rake all you guys in. I'm gonna start earlier because Barb's gonna be gone for a week. Barb's gonna be gone for a week, so I'm just gonna be sitting here starting at like 4 a.m. and being like, ugh. What's up? Yeah. I've run two things at GDQ. Oh, uh, let's see. What do we have here? All right. Heck, W, W, T, F. What are we getting rid of to add that? Um, you know what? No one wants to see a kitty cry anymore. So we'll remove that. And then add KXWTF. Doesn't W and Mario Maker 2 came out uh, was very good for me. Was it? <laughs> yeah, Beast, aren't you attending this GDQ? Right? 
Don't you are, are aren't you part of the race or am I misremembering? For the love of God! Well, there's two Mario. Ma I'm, oh my God! I'm such an idiot. We'll be in Australia. Oh, that's right. You're changing up your schedule and shit. That's right. Oh, that was so much easier than I was making it. Blind Kaizo race. There's two of them. Kaizo race apparently only six. Uh, okay, so there is the Blind Kaizo relay race, which Barb and a bunch of other people will be in. There's a Mario Maker relay race, which Pooh, Aratur, and a bunch of others will be in. Pooh and Mighty Mouse are racing Celeste, and I think that's it. Oh, and most importantly of all, the fucking show that I am so excited for. Cheese and Simply are doing 120 star race live at GDQ. That's gonna be sick. That's gonna be hot as shit, dude. I cannot wait for that. I love watching Mario 64 speedruns and watching the two like best streamers for the game. That's just gonna be really, really fun. Uh oh. Fucking bitch. We're gonna be eight, but some of us couldn't attend, so we had to scrap together to get six for the races. I had to check for secrets. Yeah, Dan's in Fernax run, that'll be cool. Thanks for coming all this way. I always appreciated the company. We can make some memories together. What the fuck? Feels like elephants. Oh my god, it is elephants. Feller HP? <laughs> What is this? This is sick, dude. <laughs> no. Oh, wait. Oh, how forgiving. One cannot win without love. Stub your heart. Dude, this is sick. God. Oh, and then you have the HP in the top left. Ah, okay. Dude, this is so creative. 
Dude, Slopcore is turning into like one of the best hackers we have. One of the, I don't wanna say best hackers. One of the best level designers that we have, no question. This is so sick. I take it back, the music broke. Can't even make music fucking function properly inside of a Mario hack. Get the fuck out of here. Yeah, I'm going I'm too speedy. Levels leave you satisfied but wanting more. I didn't even see that one hit me. Fucking zoom in. Dude, this is such a fun boss. Ah. You can actually go so far off screen you die, that's cool. Damn music. Dude, this hack was perfect. Is there, is there any more? Damn. Cuter Kaiser World, created by Slopcore. Huge thank you to Jank Lord for the incredible work done on the boss, as well as always helping with various things I mess up. Lamau. Huge thanks to Benevic for being Benevic and doing Benevic things. Also, thanks to Amber Sam Tickles, Third Wall, and You Fail Me. ASM. Playtesting. Look at all these playtesters. 
Look at all these play testers. Ah, oh, so good. Thank you to my Twitch chat for supporting me. Thank you for playing and being kawaii. Hell yeah, brother. Damn. Damn. That's sick. That's me. Oh, were you uh were you a play tester? Oh no, you're some Twitch chat. Twitch chat. Yeah, dude, incredible fucking hack. Incredible fucking hack. First K and K Kona stands for Kawaii. Huh. Oh. Oh, Lash LaRue, that's you, yeah. X, it's X. I recognize some of these names. Man, is there anything I would change with the hack? I don't think so. I don't think so. This hack was so much fun. I'm a, I'm a sucker for um, really difficult Kaizo hacks, or at least on the harder side. This one did it fine. Yeah, why the muncher there? So you could die in the credits? I can't believe Slob left me out. I played, uh, he made Cute World, right? He made Cute World and Dancer of a Discondent System or whatever the fuck it's called. I played that one too. Discordant System, yeah, I played that one. I don't remember anything about that one at all. Russian man. I feel like any gamer, no matter their experience, can have fun with this one. Agreed. Cuter Kaiser World. Dude, fucking Slopcore coming from uh, this, the Discordant system to, to here. I remember very vaguely Discordant system and it felt like my memories of it weren't very fond. I don't have like a, a memory of being Wow, that hack was so good. If anything, it was kind of like, this hack's weird. Not a good weird, like just kind of like a weird, weird. It takes you to a glitch. I saw last night that you can actually die in the intro screen right before Mario freezes. Wait, what? <sighs> the intro screen. Ah. Got you. Okay. Let's see. <laughs> secret. <laughs> oh, big secret. This is actually a really good place to find a secret. <laughs> Where does this take you now? Where does this take you? Uh, same level. 16 out of 15. To the moon! Is there no secret otherwise? Now I just want to see if I can like access anywhere else in the game. Yumps.
Two out of three. Do you want access to a harder version of the Feller boss? Is it in the game or do I have to download it? Uh, if it's in the file, nah, I'm good. I'd have to download it. Yeah, I'm good. Well, I really didn't expect that to take me so little time. I wasn't sure how hard it was. When I saw Kaizo Beginner, I was like, oh, maybe I could make it last two hours. It's not even two hours yet. Barely an hour with the intro screen. Hell yeah, brother. 